sick to my stomach by the vending machines. They talk to me, I miss it back home where I could really be free. Not free to be something I could let go if that's what you wanted. Thank you, Frost Watch right now. Thank you, maybe later. From G Quinn, yo! Welcome in, welcome in. I heard Simpson came as fast as I could. Ah, yes! Ah! This is uh, one of the sub goals from the last subathon. So, we did some Sims 2 today. I spent a lot of time setting the sub chatters. I'll be real, this was a pain. I am not the most experienced Sims 2 player. Hi. Hi Ace. Gotta love some Sims. Cute set. I mean, you got it. You got it. This is like probably the first time I'm actually playing the Sims 2 like properly, properly. All right. Backstory time. So I started playing the Sims with the Sims 3 in 2009 because I'm an old bitch. Well, it was 2010. I one of those years. It was one of those years. <laughs> Probably 2009. It had just come out. And I had a big obsession before Minecraft became my favourite game. Sims was my favourite game. And because I really liked it that much, I was like, okay, I want to play the previous games. I excluded Sims 1 because it was, well, too fucking old and also too hard. So I got myself from like flea markets and shit, I got myself The Sims 2. And I really struggled with everything in that game. I really struggled setting up any custom content, which I really like in the Sims games. I really struggled with maintaining a Sim and not getting super frustrated. And then also I struggled Yes, we should be back. Rage, are we back? I think we're back. We're so back. We back. Refresh. Sorry, kings. Um, love on the internet is randomly stupid for no reason. Anyway, what I was saying is I've gone through a lot of pain to set this up so we could even have some quality of life improvements upon The Sims, like graphics updates and a UI update and shit like that. Because uh, The Sims 2, obviously, at this point, is almost 20 years old. Aware. <laughs> the Sims 2 is older than a lot of you in chat. <laughs> uh, but, alright, as you can see, we've got a really nice little background I chose. It's this, this rural farm. And we've got, like, all of the potential. Like, what world do we want to live in, lads? What are we thinking? As mentioned, I've never actually played The Sims 2 with, like, all the expansion packs and everything, but I've set it up and I'm very happy with that. So let us get into it. 
Our first you gotta because like obviously we have the classics, we have Veronaville, we have Strange Town, and we have Pleasantville, but we also have the three expansion pack cities. River Blossom Hills, which I think is from Seasons, question mark. I probably gotta be like, hi Al. Uh Desiderata Valley, which I think is from Free Time, and Belladonna Cove, which no idea what the fucking expansion that comes with. What are you thinking, lads? Where do we want to live? As you can see already, like, the UI update, uh, you can tell from the start screen, because it's got this, like, more modern UI. Oh my god, 50 watch streak? Jesus Christ, James. People, hey. What neighborhood do we want to live in, guys? What are we thinking? I'm thinking Pleasant View because it's the correctest choice. I tend to go for Veronaville normally, like, when I played as a kid, but we could go Pleasantville. Not uh, Pleasantville, Pleasant View, Jesus Christ. Alright, let's go. And we're obviously gonna try and make ourselves, as in like me, kind of. And then we're gonna try and see if we're immediately gonna die. <laughs> Not really. Uh, we're just gonna have a little bit of fun. With The Sims 2, I don't think we'll do like a proper big series on the channel, but it was a sub goal to play it and I'm hyped. I've had a long day as well. I had a dentist appointment, which was originally just a check in, but then turned out they had a slot for uh, like teeth cleaning open like immediately. They were like, Hey, do you want to do it immediately? I was like, Yeah, why not? Um, it's expensive. Purple skin mod check. Well, I doubt The Sims 2 could do that. TBH. I already have some custom content for Creator Sim because it's very limited compared to Sims 3 and Sims 4. Especially Sims 4, of course. With its more um, malleable conception of the body and gender and everything. So, The Sims 2 is. Yeah, no, it is from 2005. But look how beautiful it looks. Oh, it is. Thank you, Apartment Life. Update. Okay, I get it, I get it. Thank you. Look how pretty I've got it to look. Can we get some, some claps for the Sims 2 modding community? Doo -doo -doo. Can't believe the Sims is gender SMH. These games are getting too woke. <laughs> like, it looks so pretty. Doo -doo, doo -doo -doo. <laughs> Sorry, that's the Sims music. Getting all funky. Alright, these are some nice little houses. You look so pretty. Thank you. But yeah, so they were like, hey, do you want to do this tooth cleaning immediately? I was like, yeah, of course, why not? Because it's kind of a long way out, my dentist. Delay is big for me today for some reason. Yeah, it's probably the internet being shitty. I'm, I'm trying my best to close as much stuff as possible, but it is a little bit. It, it, it just be like that sometimes. Hopefully that will help. Okay, we're back in The Sims. So I did it! Now, for some reason, my um, insurance, or a lot of insurances, don't cover tooth cleaning anymore, which is very stupid. Because it's a great prevention method for bigger issues with your teeth, if you do it regularly. And I was like, yay! Big expense! I got a student discount though, which was 20 euros off. But it's still 80 euros. Can I get some sympathy from the chatters? Uh, but yeah, my teeth are very nice and clean now, but I am also going home with an 80 euro bill. So that's super fun. Love the decline of the healthcare system. Yay. But because of that, my other appointments that I had later in the evening kind of got... Reckon the Barbadian so that the so show was already paid off if you do a teeth clean 1.5 times a year and all fillings and stuff are paid for. Maybe, I might have like research it, but I can't ever pay for teeth cleaning, so yeah, I, I was not with Alka, I was with a different one, but mine did pay until last year. So last year was the last one I got that was covered. And I have pretty okay teeth these days, like, I had braces for a decade, and you know, but I don't tend to get like any big issues really, except my gums so my dentist gave me some mouthwash that's good for your gums i was like cool epic oh yeah maybe i'll look into it 
Either way, big bill, uh, but I then have other stuff that I wasn't able to do. I was meant to send a package, I was meant to do a different appointment. Couldn't do that, so I'll do that tomorrow. Um, not ideal, but, you know. However, I did get all the stuff that I wanted to do for my travel, and obviously now I don't have to go to my dentist at all for un until I have an issue or until, like, next year. So that is hype. Oh my god, look at this! That's not... I didn't mean that. I meant to just go my jump card. Look at this balloon! It's a flying pig! Or it might be a zeppelin. I don't know. Okay, let's let's make ourselves, guys. Or like let's make me. I should say specifically. I'm gonna create a new family. I'm gonna try our best with the Sims 2's limited cast. Okay, hear me out, right? When Sims 3 was the newest and current Sims game. I always found The Sims 2 create a sim really charming in comparison. And I found the art style a lot prettier. But now with The Sims 4, The Sims 4 is both superior in art style and in customizability. So it's kind of like interesting to go back to The Sims 2's rather limited creator sim. Sims 3 is by far the ugliest game, but it's also very customizable, so eh. Yeah. Yump, the old cast. The old cast looks so pretty, though. The Sims 2 is... I have very mixed feelings of Sims 3. Sims 3 always has a special place in my heart because of... I think it has really good gameplay, but it is objectively incredibly ugly. Um, not objectively, but it is really ugly. I don't... I don't love it. It just looks really plasticky and, like, weird dolls. For real. But I have, like, a soft, sweet, sweet spot for it. But The Sims 2, I really still think the art style's good. It's just that this is, like, obviously awful, because that's the thickest you can make a, a sim. And that's, like, normal range of skin tones. Like, this is not it, man. But it's memories. Feels weak, man. No, I mean, I have a lot of nostalgia for various games, but they're sweaty. So it can either be inhumanly thin or very thin. Those are two options, though. so I love it. People are... It is, it is nostalgic. It is nostalgic. So this is... Should we should we be yellowium law or should we be yellow law? I think yellowium is funny. I kind of want to try and be yellowium, but I do have custom skins chatters. We do have some 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 custom content that I got into this game, which is crazy. It's the full name to the nickname, yeah. I've never been able to get custom content working in this game, but this is the first time I've managed. This looks terrifying. This looks even more terrifying. I think these are more femme coded. But I do quite like, like maybe this. Why though the range of skin tones in the base game is so large? Clueless. Yeah, this is a bit nicer. Skin ga game is getting too woke with all these uh, skin tones. I don't have freckles, so. I think this is quite close. Oh, how would you agree? Or a bit paler? I don't have freckles, I'm making myself, I can't give myself freckles. Soz. But there is a freckle version, which is quite cute. I think I would agree, but others would also know your skin tone. True, but you've seen like my time face, I was like, what about one freckle? I mean, I think we could do skin details, right? I like this skin, though. And I mean, I would say this is more accurate, question mark? Like, this is not particularly close to my skin type, uh, my body type, I meant. But this is more... Like, I do have a bit of a belly. Please enter biography. Uh, Yalium is a silly guy who is who streams on Twitch. 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 This is like pregnancy vibes. Uh, what? This is not anyone's body shape, why does that only go on the front and not on the sides? Yeah, like, this makes me look a little bit pregnant. Should we go with pregnant or... Also, this poor guy doesn't get, uh, like, any ass either way. Look at the ass. 
The ass situation is truly tragic for both of these skin types. Bro is flat. Just go without pregnancy. Alright, we'll go without pregnancy. Alright, let me have a gander. First off, I really like this hair. This is like the one good hair. I love that I can make my Sims 4 self sim will have the thick butt he deserves. That is true. Alright, let's see what other hair options. Oh, yes, of course. My favorite um, self representation. Wait, where was he? Yes. Makes sense. All right, what have you got, lad? What What are the options? Ha! I hate that I said that. Yeah, the face is not... I kind of feel like we should do the face first and then do the hair, because honestly, the, the face is kind of whack as fuck. Is that like a really short hair, or like bald situation? Are you able to make your sim bald in The Sims 2? You're not. No bald representation in this game. Where you're entirely dressed, but you can't do that in The, sim, in the Sims um, 2. Well, bald, this is illegal. Bald people don't exist anymore. Alright, we're gonna give him this weird hat and then try and fix his face, because this is not... Not bad. I do have more cheekbones, I think. All people, this game is getting to work. Oh my god, you can't live your dreams of being Mr. Popper in the video game. Terrible. Let me open up my other drink. Right, okay, cheek size. I think we need more cheek. Kind of like, like this. This seems pretty close, I'd say. Stay like there. Show me the sides as I love this cut neck. Really um, giving the most. Yeah, a bit less. I don't have I do have a bit of under neck. Dragon free for patterning the face dragging thing, it's such a good mechanic. Why don't they let other games have it? Yeah, classic EA moment. They have pretty flat ish ears like this. This is, this is pretty solid. It looks a bit twinky, but, you know, we can work with this. Right. What have you got? Thicker eyebrows. They have, like, thousands of patterns just related to games. Insane. I went through them all before I released Tiny Life. It was not fun. Ugh. I think lower down. Not that low. Like this. A bit more arched. I don't like like that, I like that. Yeah, this is pretty solid. Other than the interaction ring menu from some other game of theirs, it's like a story one, I'm not sure, but not the Sims one. Which is why Tiny Life can use it. Yes! Epic. Alright. Now we gotta get the eyes. Look, I even got custom eye colors for us, because this is the range of shades, chat. You get one shade of brown, two shades of blue, grey, and green. But if we do have customized chatters, don't worry. None of these are my eyes, but cool. That's what I'm saying! Like, whose eyes are these, man? Who has green eyes like this? Where's the hazel representation? But anyway. Okay, let's see. I want the eyes to be a bit smaller, because this is looking a little creepy. In my personal estimation. I kind of want them to be a bit skinnier like this as well. Yeah, that looks about right. Where's the dark brown representation? That's what I'm saying. Kind of like this. This looks pretty good. I don't know, he, he's kind of... He's getting there, he's getting there. Okay, now let's see what we've got. We've got the, these ones, which look a little bit terrifying. This two has no type of dark brown representation. <laughs> yeah. The situation is getting grim. We've sort of got those. And then we have also these ones, which I think look a bit too creepy. Am I am I right or am I wrong? Oh my god. These look too realistic. Like, I don't love the, the whites, how they've done them. But they do have a dark brown here. Oh, that's black. Never mind. They do have several um, browns, though. 
but I don't love the texture. It's pretty solid, but I don't love the texture of the, the whites of the eyes. I like these ones a lot more. Now, if we're going for realism, I think the closest would probably be something like this for me. I have bluey grey eyes chat, if you're wondering. I had the shading and the customize. Yeah, but I, I really would like that rather than this. I do think this is preferable. I didn't have time to do that much um, to select like a thousand custom content pieces, to be honest, chatters. Right, now let's see what we can do with this guy's nose, because this is not my nose. The size, I think, is solid. Definitely a bit bigger. I have kind of a triangly potato nose. Not that much, like this. I think the size is solid. Can go a bit big. This is pretty close. I'll make it a little slimmer. I think this is solid. We can live with this. Alright, what have you got? No, that's not what I meant. Give that back. There you go. And I have my mouth a little bit more neutral so I don't look like I have permanent bitch face. This is pretty close. BBH. And I have definitely more lower lip than upper lip. A permanent bitch face though, how dare you. I can make myself look a little nicer though. I think this is pretty close. To be my dressing bitch face though, Lamau. Yes, I'm my dressing bitch face. I wanna see if I can make him a little bit smiley. There you go. I'm making him such a pretty boy, what is happening with him? Definitely have less of a defined chin. There you go, that's chill. Like that. That's pretty solid, I'd say. Right, now we actually need to do the hair. First of all, what hair colours option do we have? Not a lot. I mean, I have brown hair. So, we'll, we'll go with one of the four. <laughs> Truly, the, the spectrum is, is, is grey. But I actually quite like this brown because it's very close to my actual hair colour. But, let's see what we got. Top hat. Ridiculous hats. But I'm like, who would ever give any of these hats to their sim? Like, this hat, where like, no, not a strand of hair is visible. What is happening? Oh, we do have a bald head! I'm sorry I missed you behind all of the hats. I have so many questions. He looks horrifying, like this. But okay. Ah, yes. Definitely the vibe. The low poly ears are sending me, not gonna lie. Yeah, they look ridiculous, but it's fine. We're gonna try something that's closest. This was always my go-to hair. Anyone get this? This was my go-to hair for every sim I made. <laughs> I had, like, the go-to one for both Sims 2 and Sims 3. This one's like a solid contender. I, my hair's not that short though, but that is a good hair. Because a lot of them just look very silly in my opinion. This is much longer and wilder, but this was another main stay hair. Alright. Also this one. 
This one was also really good. This one was cute too. This is kind of my hair, but not really. But kind of, honestly, I see it. I just have, I don't have a middle part though, which is a problem here. Yes, yeah, Santa hat. That's what we're doing. I guess my favorite hair, this. I have so many questions. Aha, yes. This is gonna... <laughs> oh my god. I cannot. I saw... I feel so cold right now because I saw that I immediately went, wait, that's so cute, the one you just fucking dragged. Which one? This one? It's cute. It wasn't the actual haircut that I was dragging. I was dragging, like, the weird um, color blending here. <laughs> It wasn't actually the, the actual haircut. The haircut's good. But this here looks just... What is happening? It's so low texture compared to everything. <laughs> the mesh is awful, but the idea is cute. Yeah, I agree. Wait, where was I? I was here. No. That's rough. Rough o'clock. Mm-hmm, yes. Surely. I have so many questions. Like, what is happening? This is some big emo energy. This is like seed kids. And then this is just the same, but mildly darker. Oh god, what is happening? Oh, Jesus. That is spiky in the back. My god, you can really tell the 2000s influences on this. This one's cute. I wouldn't mind this one. Yeah, it's the 2000s energy. It is. Yes, of course. Yes. <laughs> I actually like this one the most so far. This is quite close to my actual haircut. A bit shorter, but... No. Too wavy. Too short. No, no, and these were the custom content ones I got. This hair I like, because oh my god, it looks so high texture. Like, the comparison is crazy. This looks like a Sims 4 hair. Is it me? Like, this is Sims 2. That is too high poly though. Yeah, it is too high poly. Uh, so my thought is we gotta go with this hair. This is pretty close. It's a little bit different shade, but honestly I don't care that much. I'm just gonna keep it for the same for all. Alright. Pretty fancy. Oh my god! <laughs> this is... That's doing the most, okay? This is looking like some scene twig. Jesus Christ. Yeah, the 2000s vibes are so strong. Oh wait, I forgot we have... Rings, bracelets, necklaces, and more. Okay, get rid of all of this jazz. Please. I cannot disconnect Paramount Sims 2 because of pressure, so that might just be me. That is fair. Any rings? I don't really wear rings too often. Earrings? No, I don't have earrings. Other oh, the Sims 2 getting in here with some nose piercings. Why is there more options here than in the Sims 4? No. I mean, I'm making myself. These are cool, though. The only piercing you don't have is for fun. That's what I was saying! These are all from, I think, back to business. <laughs> Which, bold. That was like the third expansion pack. Alright, makeup. Costume makeup. Oh, I forgot! I have, um, what are they called? Contact lenses! What do we think? Do we like these eyes more? There's one that's a pro- This is actually pretty close to my actual icon. 
Do we like do we like these less than these? Let me look from a distance. I don't know, I kind of like them both, to be edge. I completely forgot about the existence. Actually, I like the context more. That's what I was thinking. From a distance, th these look like more Maxis match. So you could just wear these contacts. On top. Ah, yes, the clown makeup. <laughs> Cat whiskers! Oh my god. Gay people are real. Oh, and glasses. Hmm, yes. No. I need to find a pair of acceptable glasses. Which, this is like what I would always pick even though this isn't actually what my glasses look like. Because this is the only pretty pair of, some, of like glasses at all. I'm making myself look so dark academia coded. Happening. I should like these eyebrows the most. Not quite yet. You just look at four better looking glasses than the ones. Uh, these are the only pretty ones, silly. What do you mean? Like, in terms of what looks closest to my uh, actual style of glasses. And these are sunglasses. These are all sunglasses. We have this pair. And then we only have this one. These are all also sunglasses. <laughs> Why are there so many sunglasses? I don't know, because they actual- Like, this one just looks so nerdy! I used to wear glasses like this, but not- Like, the thick frames and every other ones- I think these look so nerdy! Not in a bad way, but like, I used to wear glasses like this when I was like 14. Yeah, they look good on you, bitch! I just think these ones are too narrow, they make my eyes look really narrow. And these ones don't look like uh, ones I've ever had. Hmm. I mean, I, I would if I had more time. I completely forgot about glasses. I would have picked out. Um, more glasses. I just think famous is just to know. It's a bit dad coded. But with me without. I don't know. We could just maybe go out without glasses, but then I don't look like myself at all. I don't think. Hmm. You know what, I'll go with this, because this is, like, nicest. Except the frameless ones. Which one do we like better? Okay, do the aviator. Okay, we'll do aviator, even though I don't actually own these glasses. Alright, let's go for our outfit collection. I get this is... This is quite forward. This is a super in trend right now, is it not? Like, the is it like kid core, right? With like the bright colors and shit? I also really, in the preview, thought this was a spike collar. Like, 2000s is coming back, guys. Alright. The fashion choices are clearly, uh, something. I love the little poses they do, though. Okay, well, that is not coming back. Yeah, this is shit is not coming back, but this is not too bad. Okay, this is kind of bad. Wait, the crop one, that's so cute. I never wear crop things ever. Like, I already don't really look like myself, so I want to see what else there is. Which one? This, these ones. Which ones were cropped? I want to see all the options, this is not it. No. So I want to check out the full body outfits. Because these are likely to have more choices. They're not sweaters, I meant like the polo shirts or whatever. We can check out the polo shirts, but I want to see the full outfits! What have we got? Matrix! All of the exercise outfits, full suits. Cute. A lot of suits. I always used to dress my sims in like one of these ensembles. This is awful. 
t-shirt and slacks and not matching shoes? Awful. What are you doing with your life? Ooh, wow, jeez. Crop top leather energy. They were really doing something with the fashion tips too. <laughs> Look at this. What is happening? Like, not in a bad way. This is like... Kind of cool. Ah yes, pirate. Sexy pirate. Crop was really popular in the punk scene. It was, indeed. The slacks and sweater combos. No. How about no? No, worse. It just got immediately worse. It's like such a Sims 2 thing. I remember like why people did a bunch of shit where it's just splitting up these outfits into individuals. Aha, minion core. Ooh, now this is kind of sexy. Hear me out. This is definitely too sexy for me, but... Like... I mean... I mean, you know. You'd look at doing that though? I would, yes. Aha, yes, definitely. This is cute. But kind of a bit much for... Why the why the bloody sandals? Oh, now this is doing a lot. Not my style, but damn Sims. Is it the mom's jeans is doing a lot? It's that's not mom jeans. They're just high waisted. I just think it's a cool outfit. What can I say? Yes, I'm gonna be Santa Claus. Holy shit. Too cool for school, this boy. It's a leather harness in the back. You know, choices were made. <laughs> that was so big then? Yeah, it was. And then we got this, and then we also got the shirtless one! Whoa! This is kind of vibes. Why is that anime girl on the back? Never know. What's going on with these. This one I don't mind too much. The le the, not the leather, the denim on denim. No. Oh, this is quite cute. Not this, but this one. I I think this is good. No, I can live with the shitty shoes. The shoes are awful, but that's classic Sims like outfits. There's always like, oh, the outfit looks mostly good, and then there's one item. What fucking pack is that? What were they on? This is like Kingdom Hearts main character outfit. That a lot is going on here. Just just a lot, you know. Why is the the trousers the Scottish flag? It's cute, but it's also very not me. This is more me, but also a bit much. And we have this one, which I... Choices. Ah, yes. Loud bright colors, that rules. It does rule. No. That's too dad coded. Is that a collar? No. Surely not. Sims 2, what are you doing? That's not, that's like a weird... What the fuck is that? That's not a collar, that's not a tie. What is this? No, I'm just, I'm just like... I'm just like shocked at The Sims 2's uh, embracing of alternative fashion, you know? You know, kudos. 
This is like a lot of things are happening in this outfit. And honestly, the shiny, the, the metallic shiny trousers is that's a lot. But this one's quite cute. I still like that one jumper the most so far. No, that's boring. That's holiday attire. Too fancy. Too wintry. Oh, they're cute. Because this is every day. Kinda cute. Kinda punk rock. Esque. Chain all the shoes. So his yellow is gonna find that cute and then you said it's cute? Of course. I would. No. A holiday, this is like a hiking outfit. Doing a lot. Yes, there was one with Chucks. How was there one just one with Chucks? I don't know, man, because they hate reasonable footwear in The Sims 2. It's literally just this one outfit with her strikes. And this is not too bad, but I want to see all the options because I honestly don't know all of them, so. Kinda cute though. I'd rock that, you would. They're really like, ah oh, yeah, this is, you know, in the realm of regular fashion. Ballet. Bisou. Have some how to uh, style options. True. Cloud. Ah, <laughs> oh, there's so many clothing options. Jesus Christ. That's quite cute. Oh, this is like colored. That one is so you coded. It is very me coded. But like, what the fuck are they doing? Oh, it's body paint. It's body paint, guys. This is awful. Genuinely too much pattern clashing. You can overdo it. Hear me out, we can just overdo it sometimes. Hello! I know this is not an adult theme, but shh. <laughs> out. I mean, look at this! Like, damn. Kinda hot. Still not what I would wear. These are kinda cool. Ah, yes, the Sims 3 hoodie. Blatant promo for the next game. Okay, I think. Which one did we like more? Okay, the one that I thought was kind of me coded was like this. And the other outfit I liked the best was. Let me try and find it again. It's like one of the jumper ones. That's the best one, TBH. Did you not? Like, I'm gonna try and find the other one that I also had in consideration. It was pretty far back, I remember that. It was- oh, this one. You like the English teacher better on this one. Looked like they looked like they're made of literal, tr literal trash. Obviously, the English teacher. All right. Yeah, he has less offensive shoes. All right. Formal attire. That is a wild suit choice. No, I'll do like a proper suit. A formal wear.
I'd rock that wild shoot so shoot size so <laughs> suit choice. I kind of like uh, just didn't love the colors. Not even the fact that they're so mixed matched. It's the fact. Yes, no shoes. That's too vampire. Of course, we're fast reaction. I would love to wear that confidently. You'd be like, oh, only crazy fast would wear that the while. More like I just personally think it's a bit outside of what I would stylistically wear. Pass. Everyone else, rock whatever the fuck you like. This one's cute because of yellow, yellow. Do, do, do. That one's cute. I think I'll go with this. This one's cute. Slick. Nice. And it's got a touch of yellow in the outfit. Alright, what what choices do we got? Ooh, city underwear. Very in the vibe. Love how you're at first like all the options are um, including a uh, tank top. The wild American boxes. They're silly. Kind of one's a silly flaming die. They're too loose. Well, oh, I it's a sleeping attire situation. Everything devolves around when you walk down the stairs instead of wear these. I don't have stairs in my house, bitch. I don't care. Also, they don't have, like, they only have these tight ones, which are either boring or boring. They have no normal underwear about? They don't. They really don't. And this one is giving grandpa. I'm gonna get the dotted ones. There you go. Enjoy. Oh, that's underwear! That's just underwear. That's worse. Okay, if that's not sleepwear, then if it's if it's just underwear, then why? Go black. Briefs. There you go. Enjoy. Gross. Literally, what is happening? Wait, no, can you not wear boxer shorts and no shirt together as underwear? Just these ones, which look more like swim underwear. There. Those are not underwear? Yeah, I'm like, what the hell is going on? Sims 2 in its strange fashions. This is pretty close to what I would actually wear to sleep. So, I'll go with this. I would wear socks though. Swimwear! Ooh. Alright, we'll go with these ones. I think these are fun. Alright. Sport. One leg pulled up. Uh, the sport exercise options aren't particularly great either. Fucking zip ups. Oh my god. I, I guess I'll go with this. Outdoor. Yes, we'll go with like one of the cute okay. scarves. This one. This is cute. Boop. All right, personality. I do have it uh, so you don't need to follow the zodiac with the personality, but I am cancer. But I'm not that shy. So I'll take some. Oh my god, this is so difficult. Gay vibes. <laughs> How's being cancer gay? Not oh there. I'm gonna go with family aspiration. Um, I am, um, I guess, four sloppy. I'll go. 
Like that? The scarves are gay vibes to the layers infinite. Oh. Okay, I'll go with... with... this, I think. Mm, I, I think I wanna... I'll be more sloppy. So I can be more nice and outgoing. I guess a little less playful so I can be three points here. This seems pretty fair, I'd say. Alright, what my my turn-ons and turn-offs! Alright. Turn-offs, what have we got? Cologne, stink, fatness, great. So the two. Fitness, formal wear, swimwear, underwear, vampirism, facial hair, glasses, <laughs> makeup, full face makeup is my biggest turn off. Jewelry, all the hair colors, unemployment, hard workers, logical, charismatic, great cook, mechanical, creative, athletic, good at cleaning, zombieism, robots, plantism, like. Lycanthropy and witchiness. Alright, what is my turn off here? I will say my turn off is. Out of these, probably. Jewelry, though. <laughs> Custom hair. Mm, I will go with. Stick. My turn ons are. Let us know. Um. Great cooks and vampires. No, um, <laughs> formal wear. <laughs> All right, yellow yum law has been made. Boop. Do we give him a pet or nah? What are you thinking? Pets or no pets? I'm officially 50% attractive according to Yana's interests, silly. No pet, adopt one later. Okay, then we'll go. The Law family. Just going into the world. Oh my god. Alright, I kind of want to live in one of these little houses. I think these are cute. Which one should we go for? Let me zoom in a bit. What are these? This is 11, this is 16, this is 16. We could go with the small one, because then we have more money to uh, do interior design. Do, 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 do. Also going for one of these, but I kind of like the like little square ones. Where do we want to go, lads? Get a square. I think this one's good. I'll go here. Praying for a house. I do have some custom content uh, furniture also, so we can have a little bit of a gander. And of course we have all the packs, so I'm excited. I'm actually really hyped because a lot of these packs I've never really played with because by the time I got them I didn't have a PC with a drive yet, external drive for CDs and DVDs, but I did get one so that's how I've been able to get all this done. My sim has aspirations. Epic. Unlock new rewards. Your sims are smarter. Sims are in 3D. Would you like to enable game tips? No. I forgot that The Sims 2 has cutscenes. It does have cutscenes. Okay, oh my god, our house is tiny. Jesus Christ. Okay, but look at this updated UI. It looks so much nicer than the OG UI. Alright, what kind of- what does he want? He wants to meet someone new, he wants to flirt. Naughty boy. He wants to buy a bookcase. Man after my own heart. And he wants to gain a cooking skill point. He has zero relationships, he's unemployed, he is a medium level fitness, and uh, he has- Oh, he's really into politics! Crime and food, 
Not into money or health. At all. <laughs> Entertainment, environment, air on culture and fashion. That's not me, but okay. He's really into sports. <laughs> not at all into the paranormal. Zero interest. Good, good to travel. Not into animals. What has happened to him? Weather, not at all. Work, medium, school, ugh. Toys, ugh. Sci-fi, ugh. A poor boy, who has cursed you with maximum interest in politics and food? What has happened to you? <laughs> they do these randomly, I didn't pick these. Oh my god. He doesn't have any hobby enthusiasms yet. He has the memory of met Mystery Sim, made best friends with Mystery Sim, had very first kiss with Mystery Sim, kissed Mystery Sim for the first time, and moved in. He has zero vacation memories. Oh my god, Stuffington Raiders, welcome in, guys. You've got perfect timing. We've just moved into our house. Welcome in, lads. Welcome in. If you don't know anything, what we're doing, I had a sub goal who... Uh, that uh, we hit during the last subathon to play The Sims 2. And I set it all up, made it look the best I could, and here we are. We've just moved into our first house. We have a roof over our heads. Yet, yeah, yeah, we do. This is our house. Um, truly glamorous. Uh, we're doing a lot. Do we have a second story? Yes! Actually, this is not too bad. Look at our house. I mean, it's pretty small, but... Kind of modern, kind of good. You don't have a bed for some reason? We don't have a bed. Rip. Oh, you're playing Hollow Knight? I hope you had a good time. Okay. Steps to make our house look nice. Let's sell everything that's in here. Boom. Had realistic houses. This is actually a solid house, I'd say. Overall, not too bad, like it would be in real life. We have a nice balcony, we've got a bedroom upstairs, and then we've got a kitchen slash living room downstairs. I did not, uh, thanks for playing the pal pale court mod, but with platform chatting pissed me off, lol. Rip. Oh my god, look at the little amount of toilets. Uh, okay. Step one, we need to do some redesigning of our house. Because this is, it's doing a lot. A lot is doing. This fully furniture, fully empty. You feel like neither of those are common IRL. Can you increase the UI size? It's so small. I have no idea. Let me check. Graphic performance options. Is there like a UI? No, it's just UI transparency. What would do the? What would happen here? Up. Oh, it looks brighter. That's nice. I like that. Okay, I have no idea if you can do anything else about the UI. So, source. Wait, let's see. Yeah, 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 yeah. Lop, lot view. What did you think that meant? Yeah, I wanted to look like this. Anything here that is helpful? Not really. Source can't make it any bigger. It is quite. Uh, it's quite tiny compared to story mode. Compared to um, The Sims 3 or 4. Alright. Give me more, please. I want to change the flooring because I don't like it. Sorry. I want some wood. We can afford this. Yes, my favorite. Paint splatters everywhere. Alright. What have we got? Some. We need to keep it kind of cheap. I like this one. Ooh, now this is good. Ooh. Diagonal's pretty though. I did like the diagonal. Okay, we're going diagonal. And I want some s slightly nicer... Oh god, there's a lot of options actually. Cocktails! Yes! <laughs> Come on. We gotta get the cocktails in the kitchen. <laughs> Uh, I'm sorry. I'm a mature adult, I promise. God, there's so many options. I forgot you could do this. Actually, quite nice. Um, ooh, ooh, now we're getting fancy here. I'm gonna have these kind of tiles in the, in the bathroom. We have 10k, so we're, we're chilling. Kind of. Well, not massively, but 
Yeah, because we have the diagonal upstairs here already, so... God, the carpet. Oh, God. Ugh, 2000s, what are you doing? What is what has happened? this? <laughs> sure. Ah, yes, my fave. Loving this. <laughs> Many things are happening here. Ah, yes, basketball cord. Ooh, this is quite pretty. Not that. Do you want to do more diagonal? No, that looks too similar. Actually, wouldn't mind maybe. Some more... Respectable carpet. A bit bright. Nah, that looks pretty solid. I, I, I can live with this. Alright, let's see any optional colours for the walls. Masonry. Paint. What do we have in our paint options? Plenty of options. Oh my god, the pastels! Solid. I, I do want to leave it, um... I kind of like this color a lot. Got really nice pastels, I didn't even know this. Catboy? Yo! Catboy o'clock. So if you don't know, if you're new here, we are very very close to doing a stream where I play a bunch of dating uh, sims. So if you haven't followed already, do follow. We're two followers away. Okay, I want to do... Green wall here. I kind of like this, like, purpley color. And I want to have just a feature wall. That looks cool. And then, of course, we need something for the kitchen. Need tiles that look nice. With the cock. Wait! Cock on the wall! Yes! What's the difference between this one and this one? Oh, this one has, like, a green barrier. Pause. Stop with the cock. I want more cock on the wall! <laughs> Sorry. I think it is funny. Stop phrasing it like that. <laughs> we want the rooster tiling. This is, is it too much? Is it too much rooster? Is it too much? As a society, have we gone too far? <laughs> and we could just do this. We could just do white tiles. Kind of. It's a little more boring, but... I'm just having fun with these more out there tile options. The song is stressful. That's just the song that is in the menu. Very weirdly high intensity. Yeah, it is kind of high intensity. Oh, this one looks so pretty! I want this. It's a little bit wild, but I kind of like this. And I want to change the wall, this wall here, to a different color. Be like a pale blue. Maybe save finally. Oh yeah, I completely forgot that you need to manually save. <laughs> Good idea. Okay, I kind of like this. So we've got a nice feature wall. Oh, now it's playing a nice chill building song. Alright, happy with that. There's nothing much that, uh, else that I need to do right now. Garden center. <gasps> Garden center! Wait, we need some flowers in front of the house. Is 
So many questions. Have boom. Have these weird unrealistic flower beds instead of actual flowers. Yeah, it's a bit silly, but do we care? No. Is that a bin? That's a composter. It's an orange tree. Oh, but they got the bushes though. Wait, we could use those instead. <laughs> these incredibly unrealistic <laughs> sunflowers. I want to see if we got any of these that look cute. Like these the best. That looks better. I appreciate that. Alright, anything else that we need? Oh my god, architecture. Garage. I forgot about garages. Terrain. Staircases. Oh my god, this doors. A little ugly, but it's fine. We can live with it. All right. I think that's about it. Time to do furnishings. First step, kitchen. Can we have like... Oh my god, I forgot how awful this thing is. Let's see, let's see. Okay, first off, we need lighting. Ooh, this is nice. Look how tidy everything is, Jesus Christ. Why is it so small? What is happening? Alright, we're gonna get some ceiling lights. And do we have some, some cabinets? Nice cabinets anywhere. We can do these. These are quite nice. But anything has a little flower chat if you're wondering is a uh, custom content. So in case you are unsure, this one's quite nice. Too. I don't know. Oh I forgot. Oh my god, this is such a pain. But like that. Go like a silly ass counter. What about like this? Hmm. I don't know. Pull up some of these guys. I don't like. What about, ooh, value wall? Kinda like this. What cabinet is that from? Lurking a bit, no worries. I think it's from that, yeah. That is a shame. Haha. What about... Ooh, that looks ugly as hell, but okay. I don't really want... Hmm, I don't really want it to be a white kitchen, though. Kinda like these. Hmm. I don't know, I think I'm gonna go with these. So we'll do this, 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 and this, and then a fridge here. Appliances. Alright, fridge. I low-key hate that everything's just slumped in together. Ooh, this one's quite nice. Fancy. Like this fridge. 
And then a nice dark brown. Yes! And then a... F the fuck is that? Something. We need to look at the Oh my god, we have like no money. Never mind. I just realized how expensive these bloody cabinets were. We really need to go a little bit more um, budget. Completely forgot this is like our first house. So, okay, I guess we're gonna go with the value ones. Because in black, actually, they look pretty fancy. But I kind of want to try and do. black tops and then. Ah, this is one's equally offensive. How much more expensive are these? Okay, not that much. Same vault. <laughs> yeah, I just realized I was like, uh oh. What about this? This one's acceptable. Ta da! Okay, yeah, this is much, much better for us. You know, in this economy, we cannot afford that shit. Smoke alarm. There's a kitchen. Utensils. Ooh. The cheapest fridge. I think we're gonna go with. I go with this fridge, and then is that the? That's a dishwasher. This one is the accompanying <laughs> the situation. It's not great. We have one that's a matching green, maybe. This is obviously not. Oh my god, why are sinks expensive? Okay, we're gonna go with this. This sink here. And then all I think we can afford is like a nice bit of flower decoration. Oh my god, I hate the menus that are so like cluttered with everything ever. It's awful. I mean, I know it's because I'm sorting by. Oh, look at this! This is cute. It's because I'm Kappa Mama Nova. Alright. It's because I'm sorting after rooms rather than by categories. Because either one is kind of suck. You're cute, but yes, that is also cute. I like this a lot. This Like, the kitchen's not too bad, considering our budget. Okay, so all we're gonna afford ourselves in the downstairs area is, after the bathroom, of course, is some form of dining slash... Living room area, mostly living room. Alright, what have we got? That's pretty cute. Some chairs. Oh, do we have the pop pastel ones? Oh, that one looks cute. I want this one. Aw, look at the like fancy ass color options. Very cute. I really want this one. I want some funkiness. So we'll do a chair. Let's we'll put the chair here. And the side table. This cute little flower. Ta da! Um, I'm actually gonna move one of these lights over here. Oh my god, this is, there's a lot happening. This is grim, but okay. Oh yes, we want a bookshelf. He asked for one, so I'm gonna put that in that corner block here. Looks grim. The same chance it was for, I love it. Yeah, this is very cute. I think this is custom content. TBH. Also, this why is it in the wall? What is happening? Why does it look so weird there? This is cute, but also expensive. I think this one is cute. This is from the pastel pop kit for The Sims 4. I really want this one. Yeah, we're going for like kind of a pastel y vibe. Okay, give me a moment. I need cut a rug, I think. Q. 
cute. Oh my god, the placement of items is not it, but okay. Oh, this is cute. This room has such weird proportions. You cannot place anything, like, nicely. Why? I dislike this. Ah yes, the H&M rug. <laughs> Classic. Can I just... Oh my god, I want to put it in the middle, but I cannot. I dislike anything. Oh my god, never mind. Kill my dreams of carpentry there. See if we can do some plants. Boom. That's about it, I think. I hope we can see if we can afford technology. Afford a TV, maybe? Yep. Alright. Life is, is grand. Alright, time to do the bathroom. So otherwise we don't have money for a bathroom and we're gonna have some serious issues. This is a wild ass life, but okay. Okay, we are getting some. I'm just gonna do this. So it's for the weird, awkward placement of the lighting, but it's not really possible to do it much nicer. At least I don't think uh, it is. That I'll do the toilet here, and then we'll do a shower? Question mark. All right, there we go. We're actually doing quite well with our with our financials. Don't have space for a mirror, but lines. I might just put a mirror here. Mirror there, and then. I was actually looking for is a house plant. House plant just makes everything better, okay? <laughs> if you're living somewhere, just have a house plant. There you go, boop. We're not doing too bad. We have this whole area over here as well, which I didn't realize. Okay, step one that we still need to not die is a bed, and then I think we can we can chill a bit and use our rest of our money for good purposes. A nice wardrobe. Ooh, this looks cool. I'll put this here. Oh my god, this is awful. I'll put this here. <laughs> the fuck is this? Oh my god, it's a wall closet. Then we need some lighting. This is cool. 
got two lights up here. That's technology. That's decoration. There you go. Beds are tables. And now beds. I wanna see. What is this? What was this called? Decadent dresser. See if there was a matching bed to it or not. Ah uh, yes, this one. <laughs> Quite like this one. God, they added new bed sheets. The last played this. This is quite cute. So I'll put the bed here for now because obviously we have only a single lad. Oh my god, I actually own this exact table! Holy shit! That is wild. Does this have scooting mechanics? I don't remember. I have no idea. Oh, that's cute. Star on the wall. I have a bunny somewhere. I have a clock. Display clock. I'm just gonna have a regular regular clock. Get up, alarm. And then we've got two grand. I think we have enough money to get a desk set up in this corner here. First mate's desk. Fancy as the desks. That was actually quite cute. Office chair. Oop, and then if we have enough for PC, yes, we can afford a PC. Let's go. Actually, get the fancy cute one for the pastel kit. Uh, <clears throat> I can't believe we actually managed to somewhat furnish this house reasonably well. Buddy, how are you doing today? Doing very well. I'm hyped to play The Sims 2. Even though I'm taking some time to get used to the mechanics. <laughs> it's been a long time since I've played. How are you today though? Hope you're well. I'm gonna actually allow them like a nice little seating spot as well. That's cute. Ta da! In The Sims 2, it does this weird thing where the chairs will scoot once we've turned on the game. <laughs> Which I think is so dumb, but okay. Nice, I've been trying to find animators. Good luck on it. Mm. 
All right. Now more plants. Cactus. No. Um. This was my go-to house plant. I've used this one so much. So I can't animate. Fair enough. I'm not particularly well, uh, well versed animator either. This one is such a classic. Also, in Sims Three. Boop. I mean, we could maybe even put some wall art up, lads. Like, considering the limited budget we've got, truly this could have gone worse. But it's going all right. But it's good. That's cute. But also ridiculously expensive. See if I can't put a nice poster here or a picture or something. I quite like this communication board on the wall because it's much cheaper and matches the colour scheme. Oh, sorry. Squiggly camera. Thoughts, guys! I honestly think this is quite good considering our limited budget of like 10k. A bathroom downstairs. Your character looks like Angel Dust from Hasbro Hotel with your hair, though. Yeah, the hair is not particularly. Looks amazing. Thank you, I appreciate it. But yeah, uh, we've got a kitchen, we've got a little living room slash dining area, and we've got a pretty sparse uh, bedroom. But we really don't have the financials to do anything more, really. Is there any hobby things we can afford? Not really. Like nothing, except an ant farm. <laughs> Alright, we got to get a job and then we can do something. We did get we got a cleaning point, a uh, cooking point and meeting somebody new and flirting. I haven't played Sims in a while. I haven't played Sims 2 in a long, long time. Many years. All right, this is us, by the way. Oh, what are we doing? We're watching TV. It makes sense. We are watching a comedy. Look at us. All right, we're having fun being silly guys. I think we should business. No. Sending. Find a job. In fact, I've never played Sims 2 on PC, but I do own the Ultimate Collection. Yeah, because they gave it away for free. Quite loud. Yeah, sorry. I'll turn on the in-game sounds a bit. Cat kiss. Thank you, James, for alerting me. I appreciate it. All right. I actually really love these conversions of the, the pasta pop kit from Sims uh, 4. The items look so nice. Ah yes, the highly realistic animations that he's doing while he's looking for a job. Okay, mailroom technician. Look again. What other options do you got, man? Your best friend told you about the CC, thank you. Military? Nope. Thank you Al, for alerting me. It was very cool. Is there any more? <laughs> Otherwise we're gonna go to politics, I suppose. Science? No. <laughs> Slacker career? No. Okay, I guess we'll go into the politics career, guys. Chat with Orlando. Who the fuck is Orlando? Look again, I don't want to be a business career. Politics is a little better. Cool, bro. Look again. Uh, do the crossword. Yes. 
read and then recycle, please. All right. Are you ready, guys? For our epic journey. We've now got a job. Uh, we need nothing. <laughs> well on, then. Maybe we should make some friends. <coughs> We're working on our, our wants, because we want to meet someone new. And want to learn cleaning and cooking. Fair enough. Oh wait, there's someone there. Hello? Uh-huh, wait. Pause. And Mr. Humble! Oh my god, I forgot that you just get given a PC in The Sims 2. <laughs> what are you doing? Why are you saluting? I forgot that. <laughs> we didn't even need to do this. This is ridiculous. Where the fuck was the household inventory? Hi, Rod. But he just comes and this happens, yeah. And I've also forgotten about it. Do you remember? Guys, where the fuck the household inventory is? Is it like... Here? Somewhere? In the folder? No, the folder's collections. Based on theme, which is quite helpful, but... Wait, what did it say? Reputation? I didn't even know reputation was a thing. Never mind. I also don't know where you can look up previous notifications, because I just closed it automatically. I want to sell this computer. Is it here? Aha! There we go, found it. Gonna sell this PC. Yes! And now we got money! We can do a little bit with something nicer with this, because this is a bit sparse. So we can maybe get him some hobby items upstairs. Okay, maybe not a musical instrument, that's a bit much. I wanna see if I can get. We could do another bookshelf. We could do. Oh, we could do some exercise equipment! This is realistic. They should actually get this kind of shit in The Sims 4, I'm just gonna be honest. Because why is there such little exercise equipment in The Sims 4? Ridiculous. Alright, he can have a stationary bike upstairs. And, um, maybe more plants? Question mark? I think this is quite good. And maybe... What other tech do we got? Video games, PC, music. Ah, oh, how about a music device? Hmm, maybe too much. Ah, yes. <laughs> Whatever the fuck this is. Oh, a soda machine. Sure, definitely. Dresses, children, party vehicles. This ah oh, yes, a massive pair of scissors. Fair. A trash can. <laughs> I think we could do another mirror. Mm, why is it massive? This is cool. Also a bit wild. Alright, we'll do a puddle mirror and then... Oh my god, huge plant. Guess we'll get another plant in. Boop. I think it's kind of cool like this. A little bit more decorated. We also have nothing outdoors still, like up here. Be nice to have like a barbecue area eventually. But all right, we've done it. Recycle, please. What is he doing? Playing video games, of course. Who are you, Tiffany? 
Sup, Tiffany? Why are you looking at our trash, huh? What's up? Oh yes, the wonderful inside of the trash can texture just then. Oh my god, we're excited! We're getting some more points. What else do we want? Oh, we actually do want to get a puppy! Fair enough. Um, appreciate her. How about we appreciate her? We've just met, but we're gonna chat with her. Irritate. No, we're gonna ask her. Do you like what you see, though? About her interests. I'll get a baby doggo. Yes, we should still get a baby doggo. Tell us. Oh my God! Buy a potion. Request Garden Club membership. Oh, she's a Garden Club person. Talk about... Tell a story about art. Chat. I'm very excited that I tried this arts and crafts activity. That was a lot of fun. What arts and crafts? We are acquaintances. And we... Ah... Uh, Getting into arts and crafts. Yo! I think that's from free time. Okay, we actually need to pee quite badly. And then we should make some food. Make many. Serve some lunch. Gelatin. What are these options? Make a single plate. Ah, there we go. We can make some stuff. Make a group meal. Make toaster pastries. I'm actually so into this. It was a bit difficult to uh, navigate the uh, the build mode and the buy mode, honestly, compared to some small. Some visitors have arrived! Yeah, but he's just gonna use the, the pan, I imagine. But so many people! Oh my god! Nina Caliente, hello! Brandy Broke and Derek is just going behind the house for no reason. Bro is just like, let me scoop out this house, because I'm going to break it next time you're not here. Because that was fucking weird. Why he's just walking by the house and walking back like, hmm, got to check this place out. <clears throat> Bro, I'm... Tiffany, I mean, I'm glad we're getting close, but not this close. Ahem. <clears throat> just saying. Can we greet some people? Uh, okay, he's using the oven to do toasties? Okay. You do you, bitch. Alright. Oh! Fucking hell! Ex <laughs> My brother in Christ, we just moved in! Are you kidding? Are you kidding? First meal you've ever made and you immediately like, let me burn down my entire house. Thanks, but- and everyone else is just like freaking out not being helpful. Classic. Classic. This is indeed very classic Sims 2. <laughs> A good house, bro! Not in the cock kitchen! How dare you! Oh my god! Christ almighty! Oh, he's upset about the environment. Oh, okay, the environment's better. Get toaster pastries. Oh my god. Fears. Well, I think he got his fears. Rejected for being played with Tiffany. Be rejected for flood. Oh yeah, this is not tasty. Um, I'm just gonna say clean that up. Like, I don't want to eat that. I'm sorry. Goodbye. Maybe next time you just try some cereal. Just gotta be honest. Maybe we just gotta keep it safe before you have any cooking skill at all. Oh yeah. Fire. Burnt toast pastries. Yeah, that's not looking too strong for you. Oh, oh, he's smelling badly. Well, time to take a shower! 
And after that, have your cereal. I swear to god, if someone eats the cereal while he's in the shower. Have a good shower! Enjoy yourself, and still- Tiffany's still around! And Darren. Have a little chat. Oh, someone farted. Oh, it's just smelly. What do we want? Buy a fire alarm. Okay, fair enough. What, fair play. How about a fire alarm, you know? <laughs> you want to fall in love? Aww. That's my guy. Bro! That... The disrespect. The disrespect of eating my cereal after I spent all that time preparing it. Also, the cereal looks like dog food. But okay. Well, time to make more food, I guess. Make some more cereal. Talking about making out with Darren. How are we feeling towards these people? Just met, and we're acquaintances with the Tiffany. Also, we are afraid of getting sick. See you later. Bro. Darren really just walked around the house suspiciously, came in, watched TV, stole our cereal, and fucking left. How dare he. I have beef with Darren now. Darren can leave and never return. You are definitely not a dreamer, okay? You're not a dream boy. Leave. I'm eating. So why is everyone smelling in the house? Jesus Christ. It's 420. Can I... Can I say goodbye, please, Tiffany? I mean, I like you and everything, but can you just leave? Goodbye. Clean up. We're still hungry. Great. Dog! Holy shit, wait, there's a dog! Dog spotted! Ignore the chores. Oh my gosh, he's so cute! I'm greeting him. Why do- why does he keep doing that? He just keeps weirdly saluting. Oh, puppy! Hello! Because it's sunny. Silly. He's protecting his eyes, bitch. Feed a treat. Oh, he doesn't like us. Wait, we're gonna Fe play fetch with the dog. Pup. He's so cute. Oh, we're getting along with the pup now. I barely know this pet, but I'm sure after a little playing and some affection, we could become pretty good friends. Oh, yes. Actually, we did love these bushes here, by the way. Very cute. All right, let's do some fetch with the pup. Oh, my brother in Christ. Why are you incompetent? Play fetch. Ah, you got the stick out. Yes. Look at this. Epic gameplay. Ah, Rover. Silly. I love how Rodney is just like looking at us. Just ran to the bottom of the lot. That's so cute. Yeah. So. Oh. Say hi to Rodney, hello. Silly. Just playing fetch with this dog, this random dog that just appeared. Aww. Silly. My dearie, I have this Sims as time looking for a perfect mate and I've come to help. Aha! Silly. There's magic. Sure that she's- I also, also love how she admits to slipping everyone a poison against their- like, without their knowledge. Just, you know, just normal behavior, just unwillingly giving people substances that they didn't know. Or ask for, but it's okay. Ask for blind date. Chat to her. <laughs> I love how she's just in my house area, being like, 
This massive fucking crystal ball that I just pulled out of wherever just needs a cleaning, you know? Checks him out now. <laughs> oh, we also dying, by the way, but it's okay. Alright, okay. We actually need to take care of our sims' needs, though. We can't just be silly all day. Let him have some cookies. Love some balls. Hmm. Who could have seen that one? Come on. Okay. Alright, no more chatting. You need to get a snack. Get yourself some cookies. Oh my god, the dog's in the house. Oh, the dog left. Oh my god. Alright. We're doing our best. These are some very stinky chips, but okay. No! The dog fucking broke the entire bed! <laughs> oh my god. This is so The Sims 2. The dog broke the bed. Why is it tiny? The, the dog was just too powerful. The dog just shredded the entire bed. That is hilarious. But also, damn. I literally did nothing. I played with you. This is how you thank me. I need to clean that up so I can buy a new bed. Oh my god. We haven't even slept in that bed once. But okay. It is very cute. And it's like typical. We're getting like really The Sims 2 experience. Like right down to like ridiculous things happening like on day one. Which, ah man, I love it. Wait, was that a base game item? I, yes. What was that? I'm no, I, I'm, no, it's from the IKEA stuff pack, I think. Or am I wrong? Am I stupid? Yeah, no, it is from the IKEA stuff pack because they don't show if it's from a stuff pack. That's a thing where that's a hype. Yeah, it was like an it had like an H and M clothing pack, and they had an act like official IKEA pack for The Sims 2, which was really really cool. Sleep in pajamas, pajamas. When actually he should probably brush his teeth. I wanted IKEA stuff back in Sims 4. Yeah, me too. It would be hype. Wash your hands, and then clap. I love the underwear sleep thing from Sims 2. Yeah, it's so cute. It's very, very cute. Okay, we have a first day at work tomorrow we, where we need no skills because we are a lonely campaign worker. Get some sleep in, King. I'm gonna do a save right now just in case. Ah, this is so fun! Maybe we'll do a bit more of Sims 2 on the channel periodically, the same way we did like a little series with The Sims 3. I'm kind of, because like a lot of stuff I have actually never played with in The Sims 2, because I didn't own the pack or haven't. Is it more fun than Tiny Life? No, it's different than Tiny Life. And also, I didn't do any work on Sims 2. Shocking news. Uh, <laughs> so I'm more invested in Tiny Life. Because it is baby. Okay, we're doing our best. Oh, this catch fireflies. So cute, your baby. Mm, I know. Okay, he's he's getting there. So I'm gonna have him do a little shower to wake up, and then enjoy. Check food supplies, and then have some cereal for breakfast. What does he want? He wants to be friends with Tiffany. Oh, he's afraid of being rejected to play with Rover and giving love to Rover. Oh. Weird, weirdly wood, wooden inside? Yeah, they are. Or should I just void inside? Fresh food level zero, okay. He's making some fancy ass cereal. For Brecky. I love how I always, I always fears are about being rejected. Too real. Too real, to be honest. Also, it's autumn now, apparently. Bro being too related. How was he once? Gain a skill point. Any skill point? Okay. How he has a little bit of that. Literally, this is what the inside of is in texture. So you have to double look at the door frame. We can see the inside of the wall. Ten on ten. Yeah, rip. I'm gonna have him play some Sims 3 until he has to go to work and hopefully he gets a skill point. I have no idea if 
video games even have a skill pod in The Sims 3. Uh, the Sims 2, I meant. Jesus Christ. I don't think they do because he doesn't. All right, uh, do a crossword and then recycle. Oh, it gives you interest points though. What was the weird interests? Is that arts and crafts? Surely not. Surely that's games. Yeah, I think it's it's the like what's it? Hobby enthusiasm. Oh, he has to go to work. Go to work, bro. Go and with this absolutely horrible carpool situation. All right, lad, he's at work. Should be easy enough because he has like no skill requirements. The enthusiasm wording, yeah. It's just he has interests rather than it's a skill. So he's cooking, mechanical, charisma, body, logic, creativity, and cleaning. The cute little picture picture thing for events. Yeah, me too. I think it's so cute. There's more dogs. Dog o'clock. How long is he at work? Until six. Jesus Christ. Okay. What else does he want? Once he's home, he's going to need some comfort and some joy in life. I'm going to do... Check email. Oh my gosh, she immediately got promoted to intern. And I've brought a, ho a friend from work. <laughs> Mary Sue Pleasant. Entertain her. This game is such as music as hell and the best Sims game. It is so confusing. It is very wild, yeah. Let's talk to her. We have no new email. Sad times. Need to pay the bills. Earthly hug. <laughs> I want to see what an earthly hug is like. <laughs> How much money do you have? What's your job? What turns you on? <laughs> uh, what do you want? Alas. And also, I want to ask, what's your sign? Hi, girly. What is your zodiac? What the fuck is he doing? <laughs> Turns on is a perfect way to start a conversation. Yeah. That's a bold conversation here. <laughs> They're just having a chat. I think what people have heard is a sexual harassment, actually, yeah, especially since they're colleagues. Aw, nice hug. My wand. Tickle Daniel! Okay, Mary Sue, I didn't know that's where we are going, but okay. I'm sorry, what? I was like, that was what I was thinking! I was like, ah, okay, okay, Mary Sue, I didn't know we went to the tickle fetish situation here, but okay. I'm just playing rock, paper, scissors. This is also sexual harassment. <laughs> I mean, it depends how old Daniel is. If Daniel's maybe her child, then we're just really interpreting this poorly. Why are they so intensely playing rock, paper, scissors? Why are they so into it? No one has ever played Rock Paper Scissors this crazily. Yeah. They're like too invested. What is happening? What are the stakes of this? Right, stop enough Rock Paper Scissors. And after this, why does she do a wedding dance? It looks like her gesturing open your eyes to the sky. <laughs> right, I need him to sit and watch some TV to get his comfort level up. Bro. He really stood right in front of the TV while he's watching, but okay. After that, have a shower. Did you just say Tinker on the- Did that just say Tinker on the TV? It does! Should I just still Tinkering for The Sims 2 without knowing? <laughs> I mean, it just says Tinker, it doesn't say Tinker with, so... Hmm. Isn't Tinkering also in The Sims 3, or am I wrong? Okay, I'm gonna have her say goodbye. Does he need skills now? No, still no skills needed. 
Oh, he's he's gone to bed autonomously. Maybe I don't remember. It's been like 12 years since I played Sims 3 in a while. Yeah, I was Bebe then. True. He's also Bebe. Slap. Slap o'clock. Okay, I'm gonna sleep, have him sleep and then... Auto lights or lights. Oh, he's really into be best friends with Mary Sue, be friends with Madeline and Tiffany. He's still afraid of being rejected. I mean, same, bro. Also, I love how you can't brush your teeth in this game. They really were like, sure. How about we just don't allow you to brush your teeth in this video game? I'm gonna have him clean a bunch of stuff. And then he gets his cleaning skill. But he doesn't really care about cleaning right now. Seems like lunch meat sandwiches? Yo! Just wants to make friends. Okay. How are we feeling? Oh my god, he is already friends with Mary Sue. Hype. He wants to be good friends with her. Or best friends, actually. Oh, it's autumn. I forgot that gives extra skill bonus to like indoor skills, if I remember correctly. Eat that. Also, I thought that said pimp, and I was like, sure. That's some. Oh my god, we need to fill in this hole that one of the random dogs dug. And then clean that up. Lick clean. Oh, gross. And do some. Watch some TV. Is that workout skill? Yay! Do some working out. Okay, it wasn't. It was some other skill. Probably cleaning. Do some work out in the morning! See if I can get back into The Sims 2 TBH. I can help you set up the way after that. If you want to. Can't pulverize in an hour. Okay, let's do a shower. It's sort of how they just come into my house and drop the paper on the ground. The cycle. Oh, where was it? Oh, we need a telephone? I forgot, you don't have a... It's The Sims 2, you need like a house telephone. <laughs> I forgot... Later! Cool. He needs to go to work. But I guess do the phone call later. <laughs> Just to turn off the newspaper delivery. Oh. It's so uncomfortable at work. Terrible. Oh my god, family, friends? My brother in Christ, I forgot networking is the thing you need in this video game. <laughs> After this, I'm just gonna have a pee and then sleep. Oh my god, I'm a lobbyist! No! Now I think we need to get into charisma skills. Yep, and logic. Awkward. Um... Matchmaking service now. Uh, that's actually not the thing. I swear it was like on the phone. The delivery? I'm just gonna have him do that. Have some cookies and then sleep. Vibe. The vibe is true. Oh, that's for food delivery. Where'd I got it was a thing? But maybe it isn't. Maybe I'm just remembering from future games. 
Oh my god, we got someone at the door. Who was that? No idea. Probably one of our friends. But bro is tired. Oh my god, Tigger. Why is there more? That's not even the same stray dog. That's a completely different dog. Great. Right, we've gotten a cleaning point though. Check us. Oh my god, Pe Festa! Why is there so many dogs in this neighborhood? What is happening? They do dig. This one looks very wolf-like. The dogs are so good, like, hear me out. The pets and Sims 2 look very cute. Uh, scold for howling. I'm also in naked in the rain. Get them all. No, one of them disappeared! But then, feed a treat. And... Stroke. Why are you scolding a strange dog? I don't know, because I can. Aww. Okay, I'm gonna have him take a shower. Have some instant meal. That stop sign is also flat as hell. Where? Mop up some puddles. Oh, this one. <laughs> it is like throughout. <laughs> it's so flat it disappears if you look from this angle. <laughs> it's not there. Whoops, it's there. <laughs> oh my god. That is hilarious. Like, oh, it's there. Nope, it's gone. <laughs> Oh my god. This game. Truly this game. But this is what I meant about like the needs being hard to balance in Sims 2. Get the free camera model now, that's why, yeah. Cause it's better to have the camera like this. But it just means some items that were never meant to be viewed from a certain angle. Ah, uh, strange. Oh my god, did he but one of them break my I think I have to lock the door to disallow pets. I, can, I can't believe they broke the fucking bed again. <laughs> it's like every time you go upstairs, whoops, the bed's broken again. <laughs> I mean, we have money, so it's fine, but Jesus Christ. Oh my God, there's a mini dog. Look at him. This is like a chihuahua. Jesus Christ. And every time I have to clean it up before I can actually buy a new bed. Oh my god. Okay, now I've disallowed pets, so we should have no longer the same um, grip issue of... I'm gonna buy the exact same bed sheets again. Whoop. That looked like a corgi. I think it's less... Look at the face. Maybe it is- it doesn't look like a corgi. It's not fluffy enough. Maybe it's a mixed breed. Hello. Give love. Give a treat. Hostility towards others. Play. Some razzle. Oh, cute. But also we are dying so we need to slap. This is what I mean, like, the needs are stupidly difficult to balance. I really wish there was something like... Uh... MC Command Center <laughs> for The Sims 2. But maybe there is. I do need to do more research on mods and stuff. Because I've literally only learned, like, how to mod the game at all two days ago. I've owned, like, The Sims 2 for... Probably, like... Eight to ten years, but I never knew how to mod it properly. Because it is considerably more annoying than in The Sims. Oh my god. In The Sims uh, 2. Uh, in The Sims 3 and 4, sorry. We want to get an aspiration card and give love to Rover. We really love Rover. We don't give a shit. Rover and Tucker are the dogs we care about. All the other dogs were like, nah. And yeah, we go to work again. Then once we're home, we're gonna make the bed. 
do some bathroom time. Oh, I left the food out. Terrible. Get some mail. Recycle. Oh my god. Pick up the trash. Clean that up. Awkward. Oh my god, we got home from work. Nice. Kind of early. 500 quid today. Doing all the cleanup. And then I think we could actually do some fun. Some fun gaming. It not turned off the whole time. Oh my god. After that, turn it off. What do you mean it's not? Oh my god, I want to get married. Jesus Christ. And gain a skill point. Drop me a line sometimes to chat. No, oh my god. To stay in contact with our friends. Chat with. Which one is the one? That's Mary Sue. Mary Sue is it online. We'll, we'll chat with Brandy. Okay, what, what else? Enthusiasm in games to talk about with other sims. Yo. It's here. We got one point and we can now... This is kind of a cool system. I really like how they did it. And this is from Free Time. Where they have the hobby unlockable, so the higher you get like interest in the hobby, you unlock new social interactions. And you also get stuff if you join the hobby club. Which I think is pretty cool. I actually what things increase logic. Knowledge. I mean we could do a Telescope, but I don't really want that. Is there a chess board? Yep. How about a chess board? Sorry for the double music. I'm just gonna hurry through this. I'd like a nice fancy chair. I'll turn it off. It's like a bit much. I kind of like this. And we can do some chess. I do love how all his fears are about dogs. Is afraid of the dogs getting sprayed by a skunk. <laughs> oh my god. Attain. No, I'm not gonna free stuff for tips. Also gonna recycle this. Oh my god, is that Tucker? Yes, Tucker! My boy! Greet Tucker! Okay, enough video games. We've had enough fun. Throw signed on. Okay, stop that. Throw that away. Greet the dog. I mean, we could totally adopt someone like Tucker. Oh! I think I chased him off just then. Rip. Accidental clicks. Worst nightmares. I need to practice a bit of chess before bed though. Enthusiasm in games. You can all read about his hobby in the newspaper. Let's go. And I've gained a logic skill. Let's go. Hi pipe. Very good. We just need a creativity skill. Not charisma actually, creativity. The ones reached logic level two. I go to bed, bro. Okay, what? Well, after this, we do need to get some creativity. How do you get this? Painting, music. Okay. Maybe you could get an instrument too. My god, these are so expensive. I guess we'll get an easel. I do love that the easel is only one block uh, big in The Sims uh, 2, as opposed to two blocks big in The Sims 3 and 4. It's so nice and skinny here in the corner. Fits lots of places. 
Oh my god. The drama. Okay. We went to bed really early so now we're awake at like 3 a.m. No, don't relax. It's also it's also one of the Sims 4, the easel. Might be in the Sims 3 then where it's two blocks wide. We're having him do some painting. Yes! He got his creativity skill. Boom. What does he want? Learn couples counseling? What the hell? Use what what? And he wants to eat lunch meat sandwiches and buy a florist bench, you know? You do you, sweetie. This is a variety what again? Bookshelf and study. Bro really was like, oh I'm gonna paint one painting immediately down the rabbit hole of life. Okay, how do you do that? That was our bookshelf. Great, another creativity point, very nice. Uh study. How? What, what which one? Be mean. I'm so confused. Help learn this useful use a bookshelf and study. Huh? I'm so confused. Anyway. Make the bed and have a pee before So probably wash your hands for your hygiene. Oh he's taking a shower perfect before he has to go to work. Thanks for your autonomous approach. Perfect, and now get ready to go to work. How long does he actually work? At uh, 8 to 2 now, which is quite nice. So, bro, can you stop going into my house? But he can actually now read the sections. And I love this mechanic. That you can now read about it. Ooh. Pull weeds. Um, that you can now read about your hobbies in the newspaper if you have enough interest in them. I think that's quite cool. So I have arts and crafts now, number two. Very cool. I've not played much with free time at all, by the way. Like, it was one of the last packs I ended up getting at some point, so... I'm hyped to see the content that I've not actually experienced much with. Or experimented much with. Oh my god, he got promoted to campaign manager! Yo, he now needs Charisma 2 and Logic 2. Does it go back down if you don't do the hobby for long enough? Because I think that would be a cool distinction from skills. I, it does, if I remember correctly. Okay, but anybody would want to read about it in the news anymore. If I remember correctly, it does go down. But I'm not 100%. Oh no, I do remember it though. I remember like the notification that was like, oh, this sim hasn't engaged with this thing in a long time. And then it can go down. Be in the zone. That's hype. I do love the couples counseling. I'm so amused by that. Right then, recycle this. Pull in some weeds. Then clean that up. Clean the toilet. Clean that sink. Clean this. Gonna have him clean a bunch of stuff and then I'm gonna have him make lunch meat sandwiches. Are we still friends? My brother in Christ. I'm trying, okay, I'm trying. I'm gonna call her. Why is he upset? I don't know. Doing all the cleaning and getting some lunch meats. Learn some cooking, let's go. Eat. Call Mary Sue. Just talk. Mary La Sue. Mary Sue. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna have him eat and then uh, do his little bathroom duties. By a florist bench. Bloody drama queen. 
think that's from here, right? That's toy bench. Floral work. Oh my god. Okay, you could have a floral workstation, I guess. Make a bouquet, I guess. Get a bronze flower. Direct the sims to use objects that do social right to it. Hit every talent badge's connect to particular skill. We're best friends with Mary Sue and also go on a mountain vacation? Okay. This is giving... Midlife crisis. Oh wait, you're getting a call. You're getting a call! Bitch! Let me answer the call! Oh, it's someone calling us. Damn. I have to queue up this stuff again. Christ's sakes. There you go. Yeah, because you can get the these talent badges over here. I've never gotten in the game ever. <laughs> and also clean that up. Have a nice shower, enjoy yourself. Customize your craftable? Yo, this simple, simple flower arrangement is a great way to say just friends. Could it be more? Is it my hair? Do I stink? Questions arise, yet no answers come forth. In the romantic comedy of life, sometimes you're the one left with a handful of daisies. Yeah. I did not know this. I finished the bouquet. Cool. Alright. Sleep. Are you upset? Because you're about to fall asleep. Oh yeah, and I remember. Oh, we can get the money tree now. <laughs> Where the hell was the bouquet? Oh, it's still here. Nice. Look at that. Ta-da! My first ever bouquet! Isn't it stunning? Hey, bro, it's tired though. <laughs> I'm just gonna have him sleep and use the opportunity to save again. I'm low key invested. <laughs> Alright, lads, I'm gonna get something more to drink. I wanna continue playing. And I've ran out of both my drinks already. I will see you in a moment. Enjoy the. I'm gonna have him sleep on one fast mode so he doesn't kill himself while I'm gone for merely a moment. <laughs> Entertain yourselves. I want to play like maybe another 15 minutes or so because I do want to hang out with Elle after this and I don't want it to be too late for him. Silly. All right now he can speed sleep. I got this coffee they've got fancy espresso macchiato. Man, I'm actually really enjoying this. I didn't think I would get like so into it, but now that I'm re-familiarizing with myself and also some of the more annoying bits are kind of mixed, I'm hyped. And I think the ones and fears are so fun. Let's go to work in an hour, okay. He's painting autonomously until he has to go to work, okay. Enjoy yourself. And he made his bed this time, thank you. How nice. And have him read his sections once he comes home from work and recycle. Do 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 do. Get mad. Halloween is approaching and the anime always makes his own costume. He's not sure, however, if he should wear it to work on Halloween. If co-workers will wear costumes, it make, makes sense. Otherwise, Yellow might stand out in a bad way. Should Yellow wear his costume to work? I don't think so. You can always pretend that his normal outfit is a costume. 
But it's very difficult to pretend that your costume is normal clothes. Because I'm just like dreading, like what if he's the only one who dressed up? That's worse than being the only one not dressed up in my opinion. And he's a politician, Ugh, a politician, he's a campaign manager, like... I don't know if that's like the environment. I'm gonna say no, don't wear. Decides to leave the costume at home but is talking about it at work when one of his colleagues asks if he has any pictures. The other shows some and his colleagues are so impressed he hands him a membership card to a secret lot. Oh ho. That is exciting. He really wants to do the bronze flower, he wants to talk about his hobby and he wants to gain his coupon. How do the secret lots work? Anyone know? Does he just now have access to a secret lot? My god, wait, is that Rover? Yes! My boy! Pup! He is back! He's roving! No, he's gone again. Despair. Oh, he's afraid of, of them being spread by skunk and therefore also of, of having something stolen. Yeah, maybe I should have a an alarm. Just out of, you know, out of like curiosity slash security. Maybe we should have. Could the place be? Could, can't the place on a diagonal wall? Ah, oh, Christ. Truly, since two moments. I want to try and have him invite. Ooh, subscribe to magazine. That's cool. I'm going to have him invite Mary Sue over so you can have someone to talk about his hobby with. And they don't fall out because that's like his one friend. Oh my god, someone's calling him, but well, he's busy. Oh, he did answer the phone. Why are you always calling me, bro? Yeah, what are you so. what are you on about? We're not even friends, Madeleine. Call Mary Sue, invite her over. I mean it's like 8 p.m., but I think this is still fine. Invite over. Hello. How are you? Take a shower. Pay the bill. I'll gussy up and come right over. I mean, I'm also gonna gussy up. Greet her. First pay the bills though. <laughs> Greet her, bro. What is going on? What are you doing? Propose? Oh my god, I thought different kind of proposing. <laughs> friendly. Have a friendly hug. Are we good friends now? Aw, this is our best friend! Let's go! Go our best friend on day one. You a joke. Appreciate her. The buddies, the pals. <laughs> Ask. What do you fear? And then. Tell a story about computers. Why they stood oddly close, but okay, never mind. <laughs> and then I won. Ask. Death of Daniel! Okay, I'm gonna assume Daniel is Simlish. I forgot how differently Sims, Sims 2 and 3 talk compared to Sims 4. Sims 4 Simlish is a different dialect. Interesting. Okay, so Daniel is clearly someone in her life that she cares about a lot. Right, I'm gonna say goodbye. I'm an intern. Well, shucks. Oh wait, we wanted to talk about the hobby! No! I forgot. I forgot. Okay, can we do a skill point? Oh, stop. I'm gonna have you clean. And then... Clean. Then, wait. Practice. And then sleep. 
he's not deadly tired yet. I kind of want to try and get a second logic ball in. There you go, perfect. I'm actually getting a lot of experience points. The fuck is this again? Mood elevating. Oh yeah, I forgot if it's if you're below gold level. Raise 20 puppies or kitties? My brother in Christ! I completely forgot about the lifetime ones. Oh my god, oh my god. I really did not expect that one. Oh my god, that's a lot. Well, I guess we gotta get into pets. Reach logic level 3. And then go down. And make the bed as well. Gonna have him... What is... He wants to be... What is this? Can't do this. Uh, he wants to be BFF with Mary Sue. And he wants to give love to Rover. How cute. Then you must maintain that relationship long enough to become best friends forever. Yay! It's also afraid of seeing hail. And being rejected by giving love to dogs. Honestly, how real of you. Okay, he's, he's doing his best. Going to work. We're going to do today's uh, till the end of the day and then it will be the end of the stream chat. Because as mentioned, I do want to do other stuff afterwards and also I'm kind of hungry. I've only had a wrap all day because after I went to the dentist and had my teeth cleaned, I couldn't eat for an hour. And then I only had enough time to get a wrap before I had to, you know, be home and do stream and stuff. So many things. I'm gonna have him read the sections and then recycle. And then also he really wants to... I'm gonna invite... Do we wanna invite Mary again? Yeah. How about it? We'll do it. Oh, he now has work 8 to 5 again. Oh my god, we brought her home already! Never mind! We're genius. Because we're kings and we already know what's up. Influence to talk about hobby. Aha. So we want to give gift. Can we? I don't think we have any gifts. So what to have a snowball fight? Well, there's no snow, bro. Gonna have him chat a bit. We're afraid of being rejected for playing with with Mary Sue. I'm glad that he's not in love with Mary Sue, though. At least so far. What's to? I don't know, what about that? Accept the phone call. Do this, clean the bathroom and clean the shower as well. Well, clean the toilet I meant. Paper. Wait, say goodbye first because it seems kind of odd. She's not staying over properly. Goodbye. Right, sleep. Bro, you're about to die. 
All right, and now we save the final time for the day. But yeah, I kind of feel like I want to continue playing The Sims 2 on the channel. I went through so much trouble, A, to set it up, and B, I'm having a lot of fun with it. So I think this will join the roster in a similar way to Sims 3, where we don't play it like a lot all the time, but we will do occasional streams kind of playing the life of my main little guy. And don't worry, we do have plans for a Sims 4 series still. It's been a little bit delayed because I wanted to finish the Sims 3 series before, and also because, obviously, at the start of the year I have, like, end of semester, now I'm doing a holiday travel and everything, so uh, it's not really the environment where I want to start a new series. And also we have NSMP ramping up more with um, having the quests uh, for the children and everything, so it's one of those things where it, it, there isn't really a lot of time and space in my own brain to accommodate a big series, but I promise we are still going to do it. It's, it is on the list, it's just not happening right now, but eventually we'll do it. Uh, this year, I promise. <laughs> I know this isn't saying a lot, but still. I I will kind of keep it loose with when I exactly get to it, but... It is something that I do have plans for. I want to see if anyone is streaming The Sims 2 so we can raid them. Okay, what do we want? I think I'll send you. This person looks fun. Let me see. Add, add a clock. Oh my god, someone has done 100% Elden Ring on stream, Jesus Christ. That is wild. I'm waiting until the ad is played, <coughs> just to check if they're cool. Baby, toddler, or child. Alright, that name is Darren68, underscore 68. Um, I see. Any pronouns? No. Hey, hi Robbie, you've got caught us right at the end. Um, but yeah, they're doing some 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 Monday Sims. <coughs> Jesus Christ, my voice. <coughs> so Monday Sims Day, I'll send you their way to just keep up with uh, the fun Sims 2 energy that we've been keeping uh, today. As mentioned, it's going to join the roster. Uh, I will be live tomorrow, though. Uh, we are doing Tricky Towers with Toby Tubby XE, and afterwards we're doing NSMP. Uh, we're starting at. 4 p.m. GMT, so hopefully you can be there. And after that, I have uh, in this week a uh, stream on Friday where uh, because I'm visiting L in the UK, in the UK, I don't know why I've auto brain, not in the UK, I'm visiting L, but like we're gonna be uh, in the same place IRL, so we're gonna do a demo day together. Please visit me in the UK. Yeah, you randomly became British. Sorry, my condolences. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, we're going to do a split screen demo day IRL together. It's going to be really fun. Uh, I'm super hyped for those streams this week. So hope to see you there. Some, some collaboration vibes. And then, of course, once I'm back home in the week after this one, um, I'll, I'll do a few streams then. And after that, we should...